Every year I participate in a hat charity drive and contest sponsored by my friend at countryknittingofmaine.com. Here is how you can find from her homepage the information about the contest. You can win all sorts of prizes, and I usually challenge myself to knit and contribute 100 hats and challenge other knitters to join me. These have not got to be fancy hats. Mine include samples from things I've designed during the year, samples made while making demo videos, things that I crochet, especially for the drive, all sorts of hats. And I contribute prizes so that those knitters who meet my challenge, and actually I have several challenges, not just the 100 hat challenge, all get a goodie from me. This year, I'm determined the knitting room gets cleaned up. I mean it once and for all. And that means repurposing some samples, things that aren't suitable to give away to anybody and I'm not going to use myself. So I have been unraveling what I could of the samples and rewinding them using my trusty Nancy Spall winder. And I now have an enormous pile, you can see it ever growing, of ready to reuse yarn. Actually, the pile is still growing, but it outgrew the table, so I've put it in giant plastic bags, and I'm going to continue rewinding and get started knitting at the same time. So here is this year's challenge to myself and nobody else. I'm going to try to make all of my hundred hats out of recycled yarn. As I go along, if I come up with a technique or a hat design that I'd like to share or any issues relating to the yarn, I will make movies and post them. The first one is going to be this. I think a lot of us knitters also crochet, and so this design will show you how to make a hat and finish it with a crocheted brim. Especially good if you want part of your project to be portable and or you don't have a ribber. So watch for this video to come up first as I knit my 100 hats. And if you have ideas that you would like to see me demonstrate, feel free to get in touch using the email address that's on my website. It is not an automatic send me an email link. You have to actually write an email. You'll understand when you read the contact page.